The counterintuitive finding that we have is that having a larger image is not always better. And I think the intuition that just providing a large image and having a base feature extractor take all the relevant signals from that image is always better is why multi-scale concatenation or other multi-scale techniques have not been proposed before. We have three observations. First, smaller scale images often generate stronger heterogeneity signals, as in the Uganda case that we see just then. And our optimal combination utilizes both small image and medium to large size images to capture the signal from both. This shows that large scale images fails to capture certain fine grained heterogeneity information that's present in small scale images. Further, larger scale images have high image overlap between units when units are, for example, in a village, which means that it's much harder for the model to discern the individual level heterogeneity from larger images. And our multi-scale approach is both simple to employ and provides robustness to local and global information and their presence.